mirrors to the world of mice and crickets. When an asteroid hit Earth, it caused a mass extinction, and a small, mouse-like mammal became the ancestor to all modern mammals on Earth. If in 66 million years, a mouse-like animal became anything from blue whales, elephants, dogs, bats, and us, imagine what field mice would be able to do in that amount of time. So what if there was a whole planet of field mice, a planet of lush wheat and sunflowers, little swimming shrimp and delicious crickets, all perfect for mice? Thanks to inspiration from Kappa, The World of Turtles, a phenomenal series akin to this one with much better art, a link to that wonderful video in the description. Another inspiration was Apollo, The World of Cows. Worlds like this are called seed worlds. A seed world is a world seeded with Earth life by some intelligent life form. This video will be an introduction to the world of Miris, a seed world of field mice. The planet of Miris is smaller than Earth, and more in size to Mars. However, its gravity is almost that of Earth, being 0.98 g's. Unlike Earth, Miris has rings, like Saturn. These rings cast a shadow on the equator that makes the equator temperate rather than tropical. Mirus has slightly more axial tilt, making the southern hemisphere hot and the poles cold, while the equator and northern hemisphere are a temperate climate perfect for mice. The atmosphere of Mirus is more oxygenated due to the oceanic algae mats that cover the planet. I'll say that ten times fast. Oceanic algae mats, 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 oxic as in the Many plants, animals, and fungi were seeded on Murus, the main ones being crickets, sunflowers, grass, wheat, shrimp, and algae. After the seeding, the mice were added in Primaterra, or the first land. The mice spread across the continent of Telos, however the continent of Galos did not receive any mice, making the crickets have no natural predators there. The mice on Murus quickly spread to every bit of plains and sunflower fields. They grew fat with no predators and endless food. They spread like a plague until there was no food left. And those who ate the low wheat and seeds evolved to have small limbs and became very slow, as they don't need to move much. Those mice who instead of eating wheat and seeds chose to eat the crickets and other small insects of Mirus, they evolved longer, stronger limbs and have increased in size. These mice might not be as abundant as their obese counterparts, but they are prospering, feeding off the extremely abundant populations of crickets. While left alone for many years, the shrimp and crickets evolved larger, with more oxygen and a lack of predators. The shrimp that fed an algae have become larger, with more tail-driven swimming, and are green due to their large consumption of said algae. These shrimp are called green shrimp. Another species of shrimp has gotten even larger and has begun to predate the green shrimp. These shrimp predators, called shrimp perks, have a sharp protrusion on their face to spear prey. They also have a bump in their carapace that allows them to steer faster like the dorsal fin of a shark or an orca. Another shrimp is the marine snow shrimp, which feeds off the carcasses of dead shrimp and the marine snow that comes from the corpses. They are smaller than green shrimp and have a dark blue-gray color. The continent of Galos, having no mice, has let the crickets grow in size and diversity. One species, the Galos cricket, feeds off the bushes of its dry land home. Galos crickets are predated by their larger cousins, the horned cricket. The horned cricket, hence the name, has a large horn it uses to pin its prey while it rips them apart with its sharp, serrated claws. Another cricket species, the burren cricket, uses their large claws to dig for worms and roots. These crickets are not found on the mainland. Here are all the species mentioned today in one scale chart. As you can see, no species is quite too large yet. However, this will change. Thanks for watching. Hope to see you in the next video. Subscribe. Also, check out Kappa, the world of turtles, for more Spec Evo.